I think I need to get some slightly more detailed understanding of Punjabi cuisine. And I think we've come to just the right person to understand why Punjabi cuisine is eaten and loved by everybody. Tell me, I'm a married man. Are you a married man? Yes. So my wife says to me that I know nothing about anything, which I think is a bit unfair, but she's right about one thing. I know nothing about Punjabi cuisine. Tell me about what influences, what, what really drives Punjabi cuisine. What drives Punjabi cuisine is the fact that Punjabis love food. So if there is a competition of food eating, Punjabis will win for sure. Hands down, no yes, doubt. Hands down, no, no doubt. doubt. Yeah. Okay, so big foodies, what else is driving the culture and the food? The culture is basically Punjabis are Indo Aryan from an Indo Aryan ethnicity. Yeah. So somewhere which originated in Kazakhstan and they later came down to the regions of Punjab, Eastern Punjab, Northern India, and they got settled over here. So the hints of the Punjabi food, the it comes from that area only. Okay. The Persia, Arabia, where the biryanis originated, where the kebabs originated. Well I guess that's the thing as well, isn't it, Tammy? It is whether it's now or 500 years ago, the Punjab is prosperous, right? People can afford a good table. The name of the Punjab is derived from uh, five rivers. Five means Punj, ah. and rivers means Ab. So that's what, how Punjab's name came in. So with five rivers flowing in a state, in that area, in the region, obviously, you know, the land is very, very prosperous. We asked anyone what they thought of Punjabi food, You'd hear them say butter chicken, right? You'd hear them say, well, they'd say butter chicken, butter chicken. It's interesting to know that butter chicken has originated in Delhi. Right, yes. by way of Lahore or... When, you know, the, if you go back in 1947, when the partition changed the food cultures of India forever. So the butter chicken was something which were originated in Delhi, very much in Delhi, which moved on to the parts of Punjab. And dal makhani, if we say, it originated from Punjab and then they came on to Delhi. If you say, in Mughlai cuisine, there is a lot of fuse of aromats, you know, aromatic spices. Yeah, yeah. And a lot of cream, a lot of, uh, you know, fat. Yeah. In Punjabi cuisine, the food depends mostly on the ingredients, like ginger, garlic, okay. tomatoes, from onions. From the land. Yes, from, you know, from the land. Cleaner. Yes, absolutely, more cleaner, it's more healthy. Yeah, and there's much more, from what I understand, there's much more vegetarian than people Absolutely. If we, if we talk about Punjabi food, there is more of vegetarian stuff yeah. than the non-vegetarian stuff. Which makes sense, the land is... Yes, because the non-vegetarian, you know, more non-vegetarian which came from Persia. But in this land, Punjab was basically a Hindu land. So Hindus were vegetarian. So there is a lot of vegetarian, more than non-vegetarian, it's vegetarian. I see, that's fascinating. Okay, school's out, done my learning, time to get to the pizza lab.